This problem here is a loaded question. Uh, there's different parts, and uh, it's a great kind of review for all of the different reactions kind of we've seen here. So um, first off, we'll call this letter A. We want to find the best substrate for SN1. Now remember, for SN1, that's going to be tertiary. It's better than secondary. It's better than primary, definitely. <laughs> primary and vinyl never react, okay? This is vinyl. Okay, that means the alpha carbon is on the double bond. This is secondary, and this is primary. Okay, so that means that the best um, substrate is going to be the SN2. I mean, the uh, secondary alkyl chloride. Okay, best nucleophile in uh, DMSO um, for polar aprotic solvent is going to be the more basic. nucleophile okay we have acetate we have ethoxide and then this neutral thing so this right here is the most basic all right you might have to refer to a pka table but i won't go over that a lot okay best solvent for sn2 now best solvents for sn2 remember we said were polar aprotic And that's better than polar protic. Polar protic solvents have um, OH groups, okay? And those definitely are better than nonpolar. Okay, so we'll put nonpolar over here. So this is this guy on the right is we'll cross it out in green, is an alkane. It's not even polar. This guy in the middle, methanol is a polar protic solvent. The polar A protic solvent is acetonitrile, okay? So this is polar and it lacks OH or NH bonds, okay? Best leaving group. What have we learned about this? Iodide and tosylate, I'll put these about equal, are better than bromide, okay? Better than chloride. Fluoride never leaves, okay? We don't see that in this chemistry. So if we want to look at that, here's I minus. Okay, that's the best leaving group. Okay, best nucleophile in CH3CN. Let's make a major note of that. This is a polar A product solvent, right? Because it lacks OH or NH bonds. And the trend for your polar A product solvents are that fluoride is better than chloride, it's better than bromide, it's better than iodide. So it's the smaller ion that can't be solvated, and it's uh, more basic, okay? It's more basic. Best nucleophile in water, that's polar protic, right? Polar protic, and the uh, trend in nucleophilicity in protic solvents is reversed. Iodide is better than bromide. It's better than chloride. It's better than fluoride, okay? So it's going to be iodide that's the best. Okay. Substrates for SN2, okay, are reversed from uh, part A. Okay, it's going to be your tertiary, which are better than secondary. I'm, I'm sorry, I got that messed up. I'm supposed to reverse this. It's primary. Well, it's methyl. Okay, halides better than primary, better than secondary which are much better than tertiary substituents and of course vinyl substituents don't react okay so this is technically an aromatic but we'll call this a vinyl okay so that's an sp2 hybridized guy so we're going to cross that out that won't react at all okay and now we need to carefully consider this is methyl okay this guy here is secondary and this carbon's connected to one so it's primary okay so it's the methyl halide that's going to be uh, the best choice, okay, for an SN2 reaction. For SN1, your solvents are going to be um, polar protic is better than polar a protic, which is going to be better than you know nonpolar. We don't, we don't have any nonpolar things here, okay? 
So again, remember that polar protic have OH bonds or NH bonds in the Lewis structure. So this guy here has an OH bond. This one doesn't. This has no NH bonds or OH bonds, and this has no NH bonds. So it's methanol that's the only protic solvent here listed. Okay. This is acetone. This is DMF in the middle. And this is acetonitrile. Usually we use the words in a reaction arrow, not the structures. Okay. Um, that's it for this problem. Thank you for watching, and please do consider subscribing.